Look at this chat right here. Space Marine Warhammer 40k. Because we're going to be playing the co-op on Sunday. I cannot wait to play this game with three people because I would dread to play this game on a higher difficulty with AI companions. That would be horrendous. I think I'll move myself in this corner right here. As intended. Yeah, Alpha went normal, I think. That's what I gathered. In the 44th millennium, humanity stands on the brink of annihilation. The galaxy spanning imperium of man is beset on all sides by hostile aliens, threatened from within by traitors and heretics. It is an age of constant war, a new dark age, in which enlightenment is replaced by superstition, rhetoric, and blind prayer. To live in such times is to be one amongst untold billions, existing in the cruelest and bloodiest regime imaginable. <gasps> yeah, solo normal's fine. F for co-op, I, I could see myself playing veteran. Especially with... Uh, competent players like Tommy and Elf. Nobody puts them in the corner except for myself. That is correct. That's right. That is right. Kadaku. Yeah, let's cleanse the planet of Kotaku. Of th their uh, aliens. Honestly, I've been looking forward to this game for quite some time. Uh, for those who don't know, Mark Strong, the actor who was also in, um, I think it was, uh, I'm trying to think, what was it again? Kingsman, I think he was. He is actually he actually voiced the character in uh, the first game. Sa uh, that's the main character of Titus or Titus or whatever you want to call him. And uh, sadly, he's not reprising the, the role this time, but they got a very good replacement of an actor who was in uh, Vikings. And I think he did a better job. Oh, yeah, he was. Wasn't he in, was he in Sherlock Holmes? Oh, oh, yeah, he was. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, he was. You're right. Captain Titty. <laughs> good one, 40. Yeah. Um, funny story. I don't know if you know know the actor Stanley Tucci. Uh, he's now bald for the most part, but so is Mark Strong. If you put the, these two in the same room, you would think they're twins or brothers at least. The resemblance is very uncanny, especially if they both wear these uh, rimmed glasses. It is insane. But yeah, we're gonna miss Mark Strong's voice performance because he did an excellent job in the first game. But it is what it is. Yeah, me and my infinite wisdom actually sold my physical copy of the original War, uh, Warhammer Space Marine 1 back in the day. I actually used to, used to own a copy for uh, PS3, I think. But yeah. Death Watch Team Kill, Pro Kill Team Primus. Let's freaking go. How's this? How's the game looking for you guys? I hope it's looking good. Hey guys, Rick. How's it going, brother? Wait, Mark Strong was in Green Lantern? What? Really? Got auto ups getting on anyway. That is true. Man, can't can't these developers, this team, can't they work on a new Gears of War for for uh, Microsoft? Wait, he was Sinestro? No way. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. Well, to be fair, the Green Lantern movie is very forgettable, so... Yeah. I want a saw blade, by the way. I want one for home, so I can... Uh, just do some basic... Uh, destruction. Man, this game looks crispy AF. Box check. Repeat. Kill team leader to squad. Confirm box contact. 
Mom, I purposely forgot the Green Lantern movie existed. The same daily dysfunction. Same. Look, hit the crew. Well, to be fair, t teachers, you have to ask the Chinese about that virus bomb, that's, but that's just me. <clears throat> Which is for the member message, by the way, Tommy. Appreciate it, brother. Ten months as a smooth sir, already. Did you smoke everything today? I guess I did. I don't know. I was in Horny House stream last night and made the discovery that this mighty Warcraft fears your name. <laughs> oh no. So my name my name is a Warcry now? Interesting. I didn't know that. Oh my god. That's that's hilarious. My god, this looks freaking disgusting, man. I gotta, gotta say, you can talk smack all you want about consoles. This game looks actually pretty good on PS5. I've seen it running on Xbox. It looked pretty damn good, too. But this this looks pretty good. Homagons, or as I call them, homocons. Because that's what they are. 10 viewers, holy smokes guys. Crazy attendance already. Right, let's get this show on the road. Ooh, oh heck yeah, heck yeah. Ooh, ooh. Alright. Can you rift this MFR? Right, damage depletes armor. Armor to regenerates after a small delay. Recently, your health can be restored by dealing damage. The white line indicates the maximum regeneration amount. Okay. Fair enough. With this console, only 60 FPS. Well, well, yeah. I'm willing to make that sacrifice, though, because YouTube doesn't do more than 60 at the moment anyway. It's fine. Imagine walking around in that freaking armor, though. Holy smokes. That must be heavy. Heavy attacks. Hold R1 to finish a chainsaw combo with a heavy attack. The longer the combo, the more powerful the heavy attack. Use heavy attacks against large groups of enemies. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright, let's go. Share the glory. L1 to parry. Common attacks and attacks with the blue indicator can be parried. Perfectly timed parries will instantly, instantly kill smaller enemies and stagger out the larger enemies. I gotta say, the. Fr the Parry frame is very forgiven. Giving. Spores. Spores. Press that one when an enemy attacks to parry. Oh, well. Ha ha! Heresy detected. Whoop. Kill them all, baby. <laughs> well, I love the sound they make. Can we get a Space Marine from for Mortal Kombat game? Pro tip, watch the screen in time for normal attacks as well. Not to the blue. Ooh. Yeah, the Green Lantern movie apparently happened, Rick. I, I can barely remember it, but it actually did happen, yeah. The per parry that is. Okay. Right, dodge. Press X to um, dodge attacks marked with a red indicator. These attacks cannot be parried. Press R3 to so lock the camera onto large enemies such as the Tyranid Warriors. Alright. Well, 
While an enemy is incapacitated, press R three to perform a finisher to restore some armor. Those armors must be smelly as fuck as well. Well, that's just me. Alright, interact with this MFR. I could have kicked that myself. Uh, thanks, game. And what do we have here then? Gas clouds that look a bit like farts. That's okay. They're fart clouds. Uh, the CGI, the suit of Green Lantern. Oh, yeah. Don't get me started on that suit. There was so much wrong with that Green Lantern movie. Honestly, I have no idea how they actually got that through productions the way they did. Oh heck yes, give me that pistol. This give me that. In your name, Darius. I swear on it. Can I, oh, you can zoom on it too? Oh, that's rad. Okay. Huh. It's a chainsaw sword thingy. Like I said daily, I want one in real life so I can actually do some household chores with it. the line do, do, do. love isn't always on time do, do, do. <laughs> I smell some heresy that needs uh, attending to yep you ain't wrong Trace you ain't wrong I you f bastard <laughs> I love the way how my character was like nope you're not gonna touch me. Weaken the enemy. Hold R1 to knock back small enemies. Mark them for a gun strike. Press R2 to perform a gun strike on marked enemy. Okay, give me advantage. He instantly kills enemies. All right. This feels intuitive enough. Alright, I need to kill one more. For the Emperor! Mm hmm. That's right. But man, I need to replay the first one again. And like I said, I want this team that, that worked on this game to actually do the next Gears of War games because Microsoft clearly doesn't have a clue how to do Gears of War anymore. Alright. What the heck? Alright. Oh 
Okay. Normally I wouldn't run away, but in this, in this case it's warranted. Man, could you imagine this game with the soundtrack of uh, Dark Tide? Oof. I mean, the soundtrack, don't get me wrong, the soundtrack is really good for this game. But still. The Dark, Side, Dark Tide soundtrack is excellent for the. the, the I want the bolt machine, bolt rifle, though. You far. Hello, Abe. Thank you for being here, guys. It's a pleasure to be hanging out with you today on this lovely f f f f f Friday. We go here then. I got the bomb. Yep, that was funny off again. <laughs> so I take it y'all scared him with a blurb or what happened? I need context, guys. Oh shit. Oh shit, fuck. Oh shit, fuck. The Emperor. I am off for the weekend, uh, Rick. I worked yesterday and the day before. I actually returned on Tuesday, so I was still a little jet lagged, but I'm doing pretty good, all things considered. Oh, oh, that was oh, that was brutal. Oh. Heck yeah. Look at this. Hold R1 to break enemies' blocks with heavy attacks. That's good to know. Friday the 13th indeed, yeah.
Yep, that was dumb. Uh, okay. Right. Well, nothing wrong with uh, dying, dying at least once. Mission to water, critical injuries. For each one that fa falls at, 100 enemies, at least 100 enemies will die. No, I'm not going to bother watching any horror movies today. I'm good. Was being swamped with those bone like demon wire dogs things they were fighting his voice was going higher and higher i said no one there was mighty battle cry and he laughed a bit yeah oh, you, you ain't wrong <laughs> motherfucker oh you can go f yourself now big guy There you go. Boom. Easy. Halloween event in preparation for film club. Ooh. Good call, good call. I watched the horror that was the uh, debate between uh, VP KH and uh, uh, President D D DJT. Again, because that was pretty funny to watch. I have the bomb. I will bring it to you and then blow up everything for the God Emperor. Halloween Film Club. Hmm. Good call, actually. Please tell me it's not for the Rob Zombie ver version. Oh, please no. That's that's heresy, Rick. We don't talk about that version. Yeah, bull. Oh yeah, heck yes, bull rifle. My brothers are all dead. Slain by tyrannies. I have the virus bomb. Moving to the orbital launcher. We'll fire into stratosphere where it will disperse over tyranny positions. It's run by Stasis Key Sand Q Notex. Oh yeah, that is oh yeah. Oh yeah, they did do that, that's true. Do a tactical reload real quick. Rocket launcher. Could have done that too. There you go. Augment vision. Hold L2 and toggle L3 to zoom in. Yep, I did, just did that. Some of the developers that worked on this game also worked on Days Gone. Believe it or not. Very underrated game. Days gone. Very, very underrated game. I'm gonna be playing that relatively soon too for probably for Halloween. Or something. I'll just check if there's anything that they dropped. Probably not. Rocket launcher! You haven't seen the new Beetlejuice movie? Mm, I have not. I have re recently rewatched the original, though. I gotta say, I didn't remember it being as uh, all over the place as it was when I was younger, but maybe that was the thing. Through their forces. They will adapt, but 
it will slow them down. The virus must be launched into the stratosphere. Nothing else matters. I actually found a 4K version of Beetle the original Beetlejuice at Walmart. For 20 bucks. The 4K version. If anyone wants a digi the digital copy in 4K, let me know. I have the extended cut version, not scary to me at all. <laughs> totally not. Right, where am I supposed to go? Clearly not here. Let's try this one. No, I'll, I'll email it to you, Rick. I'll email, email you the code. Am I missing something? Right. Uh, find the orbital launcher. Oh, never mind. I have to go this way. I'm retarded. That's okay. I love the fact that blood heals the space marines in this game. the Gar Emperor. Just checking if there's collectibles here, but I don't think there is. Yeah, you can tell I've played a lot of shooters with controller because my, sh my, my aim is not as terrible as it used to be. Great on my huge 4K TV, I'm overcompensate with. Well, at least you're not driving a Porsche, Rick, so you don't have to compensate with anything else. Or BMW. Do you know what BMW actually stands for, chat? I think the majority will know, and I'm just being like, I'm just <laughs> asking a rhetorical question, yeah. Inserting payload. Bavarian motor works, yes, but it, there's a German joke name for it. We call it, we say Bayerischer Mistwagen, so basically Bavarian manure wagon, as a as a joke. And power movement waste. <laughs> Good one. <laughs> I suppose. Bite my wang. Nazi, behave. Ooh, that was a well thrown grenade. I 
I love how weak sauce grenades seem to come across when you actually have to see them explode. You did see that the thing. Excuse me? You see this, right? Uh, sir, are you okay? You guys see this, right? I'm confused. But okay. <laughs> Moving on. <clears throat> Poop and dick shows. That's, that's what, what that's what you subscribe for, okay? No no take back, so <laughs> Yeah, it's like one of those, I don't know if you, have you guys played, um, what fuck, what's that game called again? Before? Prey. It's like that goop thing from, uh, Prey 2. Danger. You know that machine spirit sounds like those machines that you get when you had throat cancer and you have to always put it against your throat so you can actually talk? So that, that's what the machine spirit sounds like. I keep forgetting the name of those machines, but... Yeah. <laughs> I got that reference. I, I'm glad you did, Rick. I'm glad you did. I'm glad you, glad you did, brother. Man, it's been already 46 minutes? What the heck? Where did the time go? It's like uh, how, how the, the mimic, yeah, mimic chest, the fridge. Yep. 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 Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Man, I miss the first Prey game when you play as a Native American. And then you have, a, you have don't feel the Reaper playing on the jukebox when you get get sucked in see, through the portal into an, another dimension. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, so you can actually shoot them. They're not just the background. That's that's good to know. I'll be, soon we'll be overrun by things. Oh, snap! Oh, they are here. They're here. It's like well, some World War Z shit right here. You see that, man? All right. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's clean up house here. You 
re reached out for a hug, so I gave him one back. With a chainsaw blade. Looks, uh, we're like, whoa. yeah. It's time for us when you're having fun. Mm, yeah, you ain't kidding. Now you're gonna hack two on that one, motherfucker. Hack two on this. Looked it up. They're called anti fraud cancer machine. Mm. Mm. Pretty sure that's made up, eh? But yeah, <laughs> thanks for looking up anyway. At least you tried, Abe. I'll give you that. Voice box modifier? Something like that, yeah. I thought it would sound like the abortion pill in German. You mean the anti baby pillar? Oh done. man. I love how thick the blood splatter is in this game. There he is. Cheetahs. Opening. I will not rest until you lie dead at my feet. At least it's not down in the middle. That is true.
This is a huge beach. Look, must just look like a cross between Alien and Velociraptor. Yeah, they do. Heavy breathing intensifies. <gasps> That looked painful. Yeah, it sure did. That sure did. Ah, uh, he'll be okay. He'll walk it off. It's just a flesh wound after all. It is loading. The, tri the trip was pretty good. I really enjoyed it. The train journey, however, back home, no, not so much. I can tell you a little more on the other stream that we're going to be doing after this. Because I want to separate this one from the other one. Praise the Emperor. Get back to the Watch Fortress. You have been reassigned. My place is with the Death Watch. The Inquisition can find no stain on you. Titus, accused of heresy. You have served penance in the Death Watch for almost a century. And not once have you faltered. But you will never know redemption until you have faced the judgment of your brothers. Prove yourself to us and no true absolution. What is your life? My honor is my life. What is your fate? My duty is my fate. <laughs> I breathed that heavy when I saw a sugar cookie eight months pregnant. <laughs> Nutty. <laughs> Death. What is your reward? My salvation is my reward. What is your craft? My craft is death. What is death. your pledge? My pledge is eternal service. What an intro. Man. Love it. The Rubicon surgery has remade you as a Primaris Marine. You are now stronger, faster, and more resilient. You will take your place as an Ultramarine once more. Your brothers will know that you served in the Death Watch, but your dishonorable status as a Black Shield has been redacted from the archives. Should it be discovered, there would be questions. Lord Kalgar has offered you a second chance. Do not taint it. It's my game very quiet. Hmm. Not intentionally. Sergeant Ventia secured the spaceport and handed over its defense to the Cadians. Ventia, duh. The guards will be cleaning up bits of tyranny for weeks. That better?
brother. Lieutenant. Adonis, you have work to do. Gather the rest of the squad on the flight deck. Yes, brother. Yep, they are naughty. They are super strict, super race of people. Last I checked, at least. Change it later on. Stand by. Sending a start support. Thank you, Lord. We are ready a counter offensive. The effects of the virus bomb are already wearing off. Get me scout reports on enemy strength at the orbital guns. Nah, it'll be fine. <laughs> yep, once a marine, always a marine. That is true. Lieutenant Titus reporting for duty. Have Sergeant Gadriel report to the bridge. How are your wounds? Good enough. I'll be straight with you, Titus. I have my reservations about your reinstatement. There could be questions, suspicions. I cannot afford discord among the men. Not now. Discourse. You're a lieutenant now. Will that be a problem? Look at me, I'm the lieutenant now. No, Captain. Very well. We're facing a Tyranid splinter fleet. They engaged us on two planets. Avarax, a high world, and Kadaku, which you already know. We're abandoning the latter. It's mostly Adeptus Mechanicus research facilities. We're evacuating critical assets and personnel. These defense guns are keeping the skies clear for our ships. The Tyranids have taken note. Get down there and protect those guns. Captain, you wish to see me? Sergeant, this is Lieutenant Titus. He'll be taking over command of your squad. Sir, I, I expect you on the ground within 30 minutes. Dismissed. I just listened back to it, it seems fine on my end. Maybe it's just some weird audio thingy or glitch. YouTube has been uh, acting weird Lieutenant, lately. Forgive my hesitation. I am merely surprised by this development. As am I. Sergeant Dutch, uh. the absorber is ready to depart. Brother Chiron, this is Lieutenant Titus. He will be leading our squad. Is that so? Well, I shall be glad to have a commander of such experience. Is the rest of the squad ready? Already assembled on the flight deck. Good. We leave immediately. I was raised by two marines. My mother was a captain. My dad made it to Lance Corporal because he were, had attitude with his superiors. He kicked out a notch or two. <laughs> He's an old man now, but he's still got plenty of attitude. Well, that's how it should be. Online play is available now. Invite friends to your squad and play together. Nice. I would never join any racist group if they wouldn't have a little bling. <laughs> that is true. I mean, that's the truth. Let's have a look. Changing game mode allows you to switch operations and eternal war game modes. Playing these modes before finishing the main campaign could reveal spoils for the campaign story. Okay. PvE. Eternal war is a PvP mode. Okay. Coming in from the Cadian ground 
forces. Ah, that's the edit squad, okay. We will respond when here. Okay, isn't good to know. Yes, Lord. Colonel Drury, your requests are noted. You must proceed without a starty support for the time being. Resilient out. Okay. With that being said, this is gonna be it for now, because um Tommy still has the computer issues, Horny Elf and I suggested that we delay the co-op stream till Sunday. However, folks, this is not it for Space Marine 2. We will be uh, back with that on Sunday. Oh, hey Carl. You yeah, took a perfect time to come in here because I actually wanted to wrap this part of the stream up. Alright, so what I'm going to do is this is I'm going to wrap it up here for Space Marine. I'll be back... Uh, Let's just say in roughly an hour from now to play a little bit of Dave the Diver, just to wind down a little bit. So if you guys want to join me for that, be sure to do so. If not, that's fine. Then uh, I'll see you guys on probably Saturday sometime. <laughs> Carl, you didn't have to do that, my brother. Here's some money for schnitzel. Yeah, and I hope your trip to America was great. Buddy. I had a freaking blast. I'm going to be back relatively soon because I'm going to be at SpaceCon. I signed up for the RSVP already. I'm looking forward to it. I can't wait. It's going to be good. All right. With that being said, folks, uh, I'm going to be wrapping it up here. I'll see you in about an hour, hour and a half for Dave the Diver. Until then, you take care of yourselves. Bye for now.